Hey, welcome everybody to Stream Car Breaks. It is Saturday, 1 p.m. Eastern. We're going to do something different today. We, we tried out. It's been sitting in store for a while, so I just took the rest of the spots myself. So it's a 1983 Toss Baseball. It's a sealed box from BBCE. It's a random pack break. Um, I didn't want it to stay any longer, so I wanted to break it. As you can see, it says this is sealed by them. And then if you look, when we cut it open, we have the actual seal, and there's a label at the bottom. I'll show you all. So let me go ahead into this real quick. I'm going to get the random done. So the way a random is going to work, I have everybody on there. If your name was on the list, either by buying a pack, you got a pack for buying a team when I did it, I gave you all one extra spot. So even if you had like two spots, you got one, five spots, you still got one. So I gave an extra pack to everybody. I appreciate it. I just wanted to get this knocked out because it's been sitting there since the National. Um, I'm going to make a phone call when this is done real quick. Just a side note to, to BBCE. Somebody, I had two people asked me about doing another 89 score football break that we did by row. I did the math on it for a row. It's like 90 bucks. That's shipped everything. So when we do these here, these uh, vintage ones, th there's no, it's basically the price of the box, how much it is shipping to me, and then the shipping to you guys. And then I calculate it out. So it's pretty much how we're going to run these for the vintage. All right, guys, let me get this random up on the screen. It's time to play the game. So let me start with this. So this is everybody on the list. Brian bought a bunch of packs to begin with, and I know we had some guys get stuff for free. And then you can see I took the rest of the spots onto it. All right. So I'm going to random this. As you look to the left side of your screen, you're going to see the numbers of the packs, 1 through 36. The way I'm going to do this is I'm going to pull them out of the box. It's going to be top left row as it's facing us. As I open it, it's going to be packs 1 through 9, top to bottom. Number 2 row is top left or top right. Those are going to be, hold on, i got to look at the numbers, 10 through 18. Bottom left is going to be numbers top to bottom from packs 19 through 27. Bottom right is 28 through 36. Yeah, I already got it all set up, man. I can't, okay, yeah, it's a little bit late now on Twitter. I'd let you get in. All righty here. Let me roll with this. So again, that's how we're going to set it up where the packs are. I'll pull them out. I got stickies. I'll show you how it'll work. Pretty cool stuff. All right, let me get the dice roll here. Has to be greater than snake eyes. You guys know that. Nine times. There's our time stamp date. This is everybody into it. We're going to go nine times. And I'm just going to take that whole list and paste it on there. So whoever's top gets pack one. Whoever's... Uh, on the bottom list gets pack 36 so pretty easy again going nine times on to it one two three four five six seven eight ninth and final time you see where everybody's at on here. We went nine times. Dice roll was nine. I'm going to cut and paste there, buddy. So basically that number, when you see it here, it's going to copy it twice. That's the number of pack you're going to get. Because it's going to copy the numbers with it. It always does. So you're going to see me paste this. Let me figure out which paste option it is real quick. Nope. There we go. All right, I'm going to bold this real quick. And then I'll scroll through it real slow for everybody. I don't remember what was on top of that, so don't mind that top piece. I, I don't know what break I was trying to do pricing on. So there's your number of packs. We're going to go top left, 1 through 9, 
Top right's 10 through 18. Bottom left is 19 through whatever I said. And then the bottom right's next. Now I'll label them just so you guys can see. All right, let me put this back up so I know where I'm at on this. I'm going to pull this off the screen. Yeah, that's okay. It just took me a while to get it set up. And I wanted to get, get this out to everybody because of Monday being a holiday. All right. So here's our BBCE box. As you can see, I labeled these already. So I'm going to go ahead and cut her open with our... What the heck is going on here? My phone was like talking to me. So we have our tamper proof seal that they seal originally with the bubble wrap. Alrighty, there's our nice box. Now when you see the pictures of this on the internet, it's not the exact box. Just so everybody's tracking that. Alright, as you guys can see, BBCE, all sealed, all delivered. Nothing hunky funori. There's our certification at the bottom of it by them. Pretty cool item to have. We'll do an 89 score football next week, but it's going to be by row. Because somebody said they like to do the row, so I understand that. All right. I'm going to cut her. I'll put my gloves on as soon as I get this done. Ready here. I'm standing up. All right. This here, so I'm going to try to do it for you guys to see from the. I guess you can't see from the top angle. This is a lid. Hold on. All right. Top left is in my hand. Nine packs. One, two, three, four, five, and then four down. So everybody can see that's packs one through nine. Let me get on camera. Top right. I can put this up higher. 10 through 18. Nineteen through twenty-seven. This is our back half here. It's in my hand. I'm trying to get the cardboard box out from the back. I'm gonna sticker it. It's twenty-eight through thirty-six. And I'll put this right here on top, kind of, so you guys can see in the ca top camera. Yeah, it only fit three wide because I got the vintage cases next to me. So, 28 through back here, you can see my hand, where my hand is. It's got the sticker on it back there. Whew! All right, guys. So, PSA. The cards that we're looking for, these are if you go and get these graded, I'm just going to throw some numbers out. There's a bench uh, worth 40 and a bench worth 90, a Carlton worth 50, Sandberg's at 325, Pete Rose at 50, Ripken 75, a Henderson at 40, Eckersley at 120, Schmidt 40, Yunt 40, Ryan, Nolan Ryan 65, Henderson All Stars 125, Nicaro is 100. Uh, Gaetti rookies 100, wins 500, Bob's is 425. What's up, Brian? I know you've been waiting for a while on this, so wanted to get her done. So we got an off weekend. Look at doing 89 score next week, since we have some off, kind of like an off week next week because it was supposed to be Bowman Chrome. I'm gonna call them after us and make sure they have it in. All right. So we got the first row packs 1 through 9, 10 through 18, 19 through 27. Back here, I have the sticker on top. You kind of see my glove. It's uh, 28 through 36, and I'll scroll through it. Pack 1. And this is like very gently doing stuff here. Well, let me get my, get these cards here out of the way. All right, here we go. Ooh, now there's gum. At least the gum's on the back part. Okay. I'm just going to show you guys. If we hit one of those names, I'll case it for you and I'll put it on the back. Right here is the Nolan Ryan, I do believe. Number 360. And since these are just the ones that I picked up just to fill it, I'm just going to put them in the stack. I'll get mine t later on tonight. 
You're going to get one of these cool little scratch pop things that are expired in there. Forgot about those from 83. All right. Here goes the Extreme Power Pack 2, which is right here. Another one for me. Richard's up after me. I'm kind of going through the ones that are for me up quicker. See, some of them do have ding corners. Stuff's old. So I think that's one of the bench. Look, see the bench and a ripkin, man. I'm kind of glad this is my pack with the ding corners. Guy Eddie even. Shame, man, when you get stuff like that, but nothing you can do. I'm also going to post something this weekend. This pack here is pack three. It belongs to Richard. I'm going to uh, post something on PSA grading. It's a blog that I've been working on. I don't know how you want to say it. Essay, whatever. Let me get that gum there off the back. So these are all ding too. Pack four is Lucas. Looks like that whole row was hit up pretty bad. If they're all this bad, I'll toss you guys some stuff in your uh, stuff for it. Something I really can't go against. Is that? Yeah, they're all crushed. Damn shame. That was Lucas. Pack 5 we're on. I'm going to try to start highlighting these so I know where I'm at. Pack 5, Brian. There you go, Tony Gwynn. Brian hit the Gwynn rookie. Off center, but still a nice card to have in your collection. Corners look pretty tight on this being into it. Congrats, man. Congrats on the Nolan, or the Nolan, on the Tony Gwynn rookie. And believe it or not, there's actual special cases for this older stuff. Let me make sure this ain't the Necro. Number 410, nope, 411. It's one going down. Nice hit, Brian. Where we at now? Pack number six is mine, so I'll fly through it. And more ding corners. Look at that. It's only the first couple into these now. Nothing in there. Alright, next pack belongs to Brian. Pack 7. Oh, <laughs> hey, who dares me to eat that? I don't know if it will show, but look at that. There's like funky... Rusty mold growing on the gum, dude. <laughs> Who are we on up, Brian? All right.
Let me see. Pete Rose. Nope, it's number 100 we're looking for. Carlton, number 406. Nope. Eckersley, 270. This is the Eckersley that they say if it came back at 10 is worth a buck 20. I'm going to case her up for you. I know it's off center, but. Now, our PSA grades a lot different, BGS. So these cases are a little bit thicker, and they're bigger for the older stuff. I think I, I don't remember, I've never seen Carlton. There's your last one right there. All right, pack number eight is me. I'm just going to fly through it, unless there's like a Boggs or Sandberg. Oh, man. Look at that gum, man. No, they're not bad. I mean, you know how the older stuff was when we were growing up, man. Hey, look, you got uh, one of those World Series trip things. You went a trip <laughs> to the World Series from back in the day. Alrighty. That was mine. Alright, pack nine. Last one in this row. Brian again. Let me click on you, Brian, so I know where I'm at. Oh, look at that. Yum. I don't know if it's going to come off. I mean, at least it's a common dude. Oh. Dude, oh, I just got a smell of it, too. Woo. Woo-wee. I was ready, Jacks, on my list now. Tax one through nine dead. I'm gonna throw that away. We're up to ten through eighteen, which is right here. So pack ten is mine. Hope you guys get all the rookies. I really do. I have bogs and gwins that I could throw in for set fillers. Alrighty here. Come on, pick up the name there. There we go. Y'all know what that is. That's that World Series thing. 10 was me. 11 is Kevin. You really want a stick of it? I'll send it to you, but it's... If it, I don't even know... Well, I guess you could send it because they sent it to me. But I was more worried about, like, sending this stuff. Look, that one there, man. It's starting to get the mold on it. I'm trying to twist her off. There we go. Hey, that's in full tack. It's not too moldy. <laughs> yeah. Man, they had a dog sniff that. We'd be done. Like I said, I don't know if you guys just tuned in. If you had uh, some spots in this, I threw you an extra one in. I'm just looking at cards as I go through because some of the names stick out to me. Wade Boggs, rookie. Not We're getting there on that centering. There you go, Kevin. Wade Boggs. Back's real nice. You can see where my where that wax is on my gloves, man. The glo that stuff. Congrats. We got a Boggs. Kevin, you got her. Your gum had the cure for Wade Boggs' rookie. You're in there nice and slow here. There we 
There we go. I'm just holding it crooked. There you go. Frost and the Chicago White Sox. I'm going to find your name behind me. There we go. I love opening this uh, old stuff up. All right below, Kevin is Shannon. Let's see if we can get you. Nice if I can get you each uh, one of them rookies. Corners are real nice on these. You can get a chance to go to World Series back in 83. Mary Palmer ain't one. Palmer. These are really nice. That top one at Greg Hoffman. When you get these, there's going to be having that, uh, I don't know what you want to call it on there. The Eminence of uh, wax and gum. If you go to send these into PSA, oh wait, who's the next one? Blue Shannon. Oh, it's me. Make sure you at least take something and wipe it down. Dude, it makes you wonder. Trying to get the focus back up. There we go. Good old Ozzy Smith. I'm just happy with the Nolan Ryan, to be honest. All right. We're on the Uncle Extreme. Next one down. Pack 14 is mine. It's kind of cool opening this stuff, man. It brings back my memories of childhood. Ew. Oh. Uh, well, I'm going to put these right there. I know they're mine, but I'm blowing this stuff, so I'm going to try to hold some stuff here. Ooh. There's all kind of like dust particles floating there already. There we go. Guys are doing good. At least y'all gave me a Nolan Ryan. I'm happy. I'm happy with the Ryan. All right. Pack 15, Richard. Oh. I've seen dudes breaking this stuff for like, <laughs> I don't even say how much a pack. We're just going to say they were charging $3 a card and doing pack breaks, and people were going nuts on it. I'm like, that's insane. If you guys want to break older stuff, I can do it. Way less cost. That's kind of cool. I like opening this stuff. All right, Richard, you got Reggie. All right, put this in Richard's stack. Kind of kick my gloves off. Up next is me, then followed by the last two in this stack will be Brian. But yeah, we're, I'm going to call them. If, we have, if they have an 89 score still in, it's on their website. We're getting it. I'll post in a score and we'll do it by Rose because by Rose was insane last time. I said it'd be like 90 a row. Uh, I can. Um, it depends. Like this stuff here, it's older. I do PSA. Newer stuff, like 2000 and up, I'll do a BGS, but it's always preference. And PSA, from my understanding, you have to. Uh, what was it? You have to fan jam it all. Okay, that was 16 mine. Brian, 
I'm gonna have to get like some cleaner out after this. But I'll hit you up with why. I'm gonna post something for you guys too. I'll post it on Facebook to read over. But it's really good stuff. Tells you how they do their centering and what condones a ten to a nine. I put some effort into it. Well, how's it work? Wasn't a whole lot of effort, but something I always want to do. There you go. Ricky Henderson, I think. Let me look at this. 531 is not one, but you got a Henderson. I know you collected them. You did as a kid, so I'm going to case her for you. Very nice card. It's sharp. Any ones I didn't read off, the PSA 10 value is uh, 12 bucks, And that there is stuff you spent on bulk. All right, Brian, let me get your stuff in. I'll have to make two stacks for you, cased and uncased. And this is your second one. Oh, good. The gum wasn't stuck to one. As soon as she reads her. Come on. There we go. Another Henderson, a two record breaker. Card number two. That's ten through eighteen done. Man, just goo everywhere. This is 19 through 27. 19 is me, followed by Brian. Yeah. The heck, now a light one to hit me in the face. There we go. Windows messing with us in here. Going from sunny to, un to dark clouds out there today. This is the Steve Carlton, but I wouldn't, I'm not going to grade her just for the fact it's way off center. That's the one that's, it'll come back, uh, what is it, 50 if you got a 10 on her. Alright, next up, pack 20, Brian. Good luck. There you go. Another Henderson. He's following you now. Top and bottom's all a little bit bad on center, but still nice card. Nice corners. See what else we got in your pack. Once it focuses again, come on, auto focus on to her. I know it keeps on wanting to read the back wall. There we go. Alright, who's up after Brian? Richard. Act 21.
Alright, this is that one bench. If it, come, if it was centered better and it would have came back at 10, that's the $90 one. It's a little bit harder to get, I guess they say. I'm not too sure on to it, but my case are up for you. With center and all, it'd probably come back at 8. But I'm going to post this stuff for you guys. This is where stuff is. Connor Wally Backman, that's a name I haven't heard in years. Wow. Brings back some memories. Alright, we're on to after Richard Bryan, pack 22. Let me get the old gum off of here. Let me see what it is. Okay. Good luck, Brian. Been hitting uh, pretty well on this so far. Great. After Brian, it's me, Pack 20. Three, four, five, six, and seven. Okay. I got next three. I'm going to remember pack 23 here. Ew. Look, I'm going to show you guys. Look at that. That's off the gum. So glad none of you got this pack. Look at that. I'm not even playing with that bottom card. My pack, it's gone. Pretty gross. Take a picture of him, post it. One on one mold card. All right, next one down, pack 24 is me. Oh, give me another Nolan in here. Not liking me. Alright. 25 is me. You guys did good. One Glenn, one Boggs. Should be a Sandberg, hopefully, left. Maybe we'll get a repeat in some of these. So we're early on in the box. That's the yunt, but it's off center for me to grade. I, I look for the tens. Pack 26 is Shannon. Let's get you some heat. We haven't had a rookie for a while. I think we're going to start doing rows instead of packs on this stuff. Shan, good luck. Once I get her to focus, there we go. Now we're on pack 27, which is me. We're still on the screen with me. Yeah. I only got two or three that I got to pull up at the end. Look at that, Bob Walk for the Braves. Came over to be in Pittsburgh after a while. Griffey Sr. Tim Rice. Craziness. That was 19 through 27. You guys can see, look at all that stuff just coming off of these. Not really cleaner. 
All right, this was the fourth row that I announced. Packs 20 through through 28. Or 30, 28 through 36. There are, all right, 28 is me. It looks like pretty much, I think most of you guys are done. I think there's a couple people left. Kevin's still got a pack. Lucas, me, Brian. Oh, Brian got a good bit of them. All right, good luck. Oh, well, that throws myself. Wish myself good luck. That's a first. I'm going to scratch my stuff and see if I would have made it to the World Series. Next one down is 29, me. Should still have a nice Sandberg coming up somewhere. Nolan Ryan, there we go. I like Nolan. Alright. Next pack is mine, pack 30. That's a good. I'm glad you guys got the box and the wins out of it. I'm also glad it. Whoa, oh, that gum shut right off at me. I'm going to throw this away so the dog don't go in there and start chewing on moldy gum. Pack 31, Kevin's. Good luck. Got your bogs already. See what else we can get you in this one. Besides some moldy gum. Alright, here. Well, these are sharp. I'm hoping you got a rookie in this stack. That's the World Series thing. Oh, I thought it said something else in the back. Oh, a rookie there. There's Kevin. Kevin's there. Next one down is me, 32. Oh, it's not picking her up. There we go. Yeah, myself. Okay. I look where the cursor is at. Nothing there. I'm going to scroll this down a little bit. Next up is Lucas. And me, me, Brian. Uh, was it the regular Necro? I didn't even look. If it looked like that, it's the right one. But it has to grade out of 10. That's the only thing. Come on now, Lucas. Look. I'll have to look back to the ones I had. I just went through mine quick. Lucas. Alright, pack 34. Me. Anybody didn't get one of the top three rookies, I'll throw something in your package for you. Okay, he wasn't on the list.
Oh, cool, cool. Yeah, I'll take a look at her. There's any tens. Eventually, I got stuff for PSA. It's older. Just they're so backlogged. They're even funny. There's bad. It's getting bad as BGS now. The only difference is BGS will actually once you get the the package in, and they mark it as accepted, and you do like a ten day or I think ten days are gone right now. Fifteen or twenty day, they start it that day. PSA is once they get to it, then they log it in, and then you just gotta wait. It's bad. All right, last pack, Brian. Hello, Brian. So we got one Boggs and one Gwyn out of it. Not bad. Boggs looks pretty good. See if we can pull it here. Where's Mr. Sandberg? I know there's like 800 cards in this set, like 500, I should say, so it's pretty big. Sachs, Ellenberg. I uh, saw the face, and I thought it was Boggs. All right, that's the end of her. Oof. One last time, so y'all can see. Look at this. This came in my one of my packs. Look at the mold just growing on that. That is great. It's a one on one mold card. All right, guys, appreciate it. We had one Boggs rookie, which is Kevin, and Brian hit the Gwen out of the box. Congrats. If you didn't get one of those, I'll throw something in for you in your package. I appreciate it. I'm going to try to get a box of 89 score for next weekend football. We did one with the uh, promo, and we're going to do it by row because it seemed to work out real good by row. I think everybody got either a Sanders or Aikman, or some people got both. So we'll try to knock that out. Again, appreciate it. You guys have a good, safe, be safe this weekend, Labor Day. Reminds me back of my days in the Army giving y'all a safety brief. <laughs> um, if y'all need anything, give me a holler. I'm going to get these packaged up and dropped off before 5 for you guys. So that way they'll be in the system. I know Monday's a holiday, so there's no mail. And i got to get this table cleaned off. <laughs> yeah, two, two pounds still? That might be a triple, man. That would be a triple. That's, see, that's why you wear gloves when you open stuff. It's just not because of the fingerprints. It's because when you open up the old stuff, you can catch something. All right, just kidding. It just really, I, I didn't think it would be that bad. But, again, thank you, guys. I'll see you all next weekend. Um, we're going to try that 89 score out. The following week, I got some Spectre football. Then we'll move into collegiate flawless uh, football, full case. That's two briefcases. I have some XR football that week when it comes out, some Leaf Trinity. And then the fall week's going to be madness, Bowman Chrome Baseball. I have Hobby. I have HTA. So it's going to be a long, long, long breaks for the hobby. So I took that Friday off after the release. So we'll start uh, bought a case of it on Thursday. And then we'll do a case on Friday, and maybe both cases on uh, Friday at HTA and a hobby. So I'm going to start getting to work on the website with that stuff. Uh, I talked about yesterday. I dropped in the Facebook group, too. So we'll start getting some of that coding and stuff done as well for everybody. Again, appreciate it. I'll catch you all on the backside.